Hi everyone, Sarah from Earth Spirit, how are you? So I'm just going to do a sort of a longer reading for the new year for 2021. So just to see what's coming up for all of us. Um, I'll start with just three cards and then we might do some more if I feel that we need to do some more um, and just see what comes up. So this will be just based on um, 2021 and what's in store, um, the cards, what comes up in the cards for that. So. Uh, and what I pick up around the cards. So let's see what happens. I'm just going to put that down so you can see the cards. Let's see what comes up. So just thinking of 2021 and what's in store for us. Okay, so that's the first one. jumped out okay so major major arcana is all of these so let's go first with okay so the wheel of the year of course this is the first one and this is about which is really which is really appropriate, the Wheel of Fortune or the Wheel of the Year, whatever you want to call it. Um, so this is all about change and things changing and things moving around for you or for everyone for this year. Um, so there might be some changes coming up that you have to deal with or we all have to deal with within this year. So um, the wheel is turning and things are going to change, but it's not always for the worse. It can be for the better. So things can change and for for our better or our highest good or for um, the highest good for all of us. So um, a lot of change coming in, which I don't think is bad. I'm, I'm quite happy to have change coming in around th uh, this year. So that would be good as in a positive direction would be fantastic. So because our next card is actually the magician, which is, um, so of course it's all about intuition, taking chances. So because that's next to the wheel of fortune or the wheel of the year, um, I feel it's a positive change and that we're going to, people are going to, going to become more spiritual more intuitive more in touch with their intuition so this is already happening so this is just confirming what's already happening um, more in touch with nature and and being protective of nature and realizing how important it is this would be an amazing change if that happens um, and the magical side of things bringing out the magical side of things people will start to do so um, so more connecting with crystals, um, going back to the old ways of, of connecting with nature and working with nature and that sort of thing. So that, that would be fantastic if that happens, if that's true and it's coming up. So the hangman, which is always about waiting and suspense. So um, this, so these changes aren't going to happen straight away, this is saying. We just need to be patient and just let the year pan out. I mean, it might not even start to take effect till next year, till 2022. But this year will be the start of all these ch slow changes. Um, and, you know, people being more aware of what's going on around them. And But you just have to be patient. And so just hang in there and keep going and keep... Um, keep all the spiritual people out there just keep um, doing what you do and and healing and helping other people um, and yeah we just need to be patient and this will the change will come so i'm just going to pull another card around that just what i what i grab okay so because we're going to have to wait we're going to feel that things are we're a bit unfulfilled this year because um, we're going to have to wait for all these cha changes to progress and the transformation and transition to take effect. So it's not going to be a quick fix. It's going to be a bit of a drawn out, um, take a little while to be come into effect. So, um, yeah, so that's what's we just have to be patient again and just keep and also with this card I'm getting that we need to keep aware of what's going on in the world don't just be distracted and look over here and then they're doing something over here we need to be aware of everything that's going on around us so 
um, please pay attention and stay alert and stand up for what you believe is wrong and right and um, and and stand up and let your voice be heard I think we really need to stand up and be heard I'll just pick another one on might another two I might grab out oh, the world so um, you know expansion destiny so if things are really going to expand spiritually I think but uh, like I don't I sort of feel it's got not going to come into effect till 22 2022 really um, noticeable of the changes going on around us um, there is going to be some challenges and some things that we might not like but that's where we need to stand up and keep an eye on what's going on and make our voices heard so um, yeah so you know and we really need to nurture mother earth i feel that we so need to nurture mother earth and look after mother earth because it doesn't matter about any other things going on in the world if we don't look after nature and mother earth we'll it'll we won't have a place to live we won't have food water um any you know sunshine um anything without mother earth so nature's in charge i keep saying that it's the message i keep getting all the time from nature because um, you know it doesn't matter what happens if we don't look after nature and mother earth it's in charge it can just destroy us in a, in an instant so we really need to be on top of planting trees connecting with nature making sure we watch people the government and their land clearing and things like that and what they're doing with the environment like re be really aware be really <laughs> aware of what they're doing so don't turn a blind eye just keep a lookout like this is this lady here is <clears throat> okay so one more to finish up okay that's a nice one to finish up so this just means um you may be struggling financially with all the stuff that's going on if you lost your job or anything like that but things are going to start looking up coming through this year and moving into 2022 so things are going to start looking up with that um, we just need to hang in there and it will turn around and things will start to go right for you so um, and for all of us so we just need to hang in there and be aware of what's going on around us as I said and just stay really positive and spread that positive vibe and vibe instead of spreading fear and negativity spread um, happiness and positivity in the world and just really spread that we need to connect with nature and it's so important because even money doesn't mean anything if we don't have um, beautiful mother earth so let's let's um, look after her this year I feel that this is a real year to look after mother earth and nature and connect so I hope that helps that's a really positive lots of hope in that reading lots of hope moving forward that we just need to be aware and we need to not um, not be afraid and <clears throat> stand up for what we feels right and connect with nature and look after mother earth it's so important I say it every day connect with nature look after mother earth please everybody um, it's the most important thing out of everything so thanks for listening hope that helped blessed be everyone See you next time. Bye.